I am starting a special series on Taiwan. This is 特别历史，台湾的。I've been in Taiwan ten years, and one of my buddies is named Zach.、Uh, he's, he's not Zach Hing,、uh, another Zach, different Zach in California. The not Zach the YouTuber, but Zach the YouTuber. I'm、uh, giving you a shout because I'm in your neck of the woods, kind of. And like I say, I I actually think I know a high school student that might have gone to your high school, Zach, YouTuber Zach. But my buddy back home, Zach, different Zach, says he wants to hear more about Asia. So I'm going to show you. We're going to talk about this today. We're going to talk about this today. This is actually Taiwanese. It's a Taiwanese company, I do believe. Transcend. Very awesome. Very awesome USBs. A lot of DRAM is made in Taiwan. Here's why I'm motivated to start talking about this series. I lived in Taiwan ten years. Was it Taiwan ten years? And I have seen many of Taiwan's problems. 我看过很多的台湾的问题。台湾人很喜欢台湾。Taiwanese people love Taiwan. 但是台湾有很多问题，都是政府的问题。Taiwan has many problems, however, and It's a government problem. This is 民主的问题，是政府的问题。所以我会说本府，本单的本本府。So I will refer to it as a government problem. It's not a problem with the people. It's a government problem. And in Chinese, the word for stupid and one of the words for government sound the same. And sorry, ten years of the nonsense. I'm calling it bumfu, which is. It's like、uh, it's it'd be like it's it's like you could take the word stupid and hybrid it with government and invent a word. That's what it would sound like. Now, again, I I think that the new president Tsai is great. Taiwan's president Tsai, 新的总统蔡英文总统，我很喜欢他，他厉害，我很喜欢，我喜欢，呃，他可以改变，我想他喜欢他可以改变。I believe she wants to bring change. And Lai Qing, the Xin Zheng Yan Zheng, ah, he is the Taiwan Shi, the Taiwan Shi Zheng. Who knows? Taiwan Shi Zheng. The Premier, which is kind of like a, it's like Secretary of State in America, but with a little more power.、Um, imagine if if the Vice President was above the Secretary of State, and could tell the Secretary of State what to do, what to do. Imagine that. That's a Premier. There's more. I won't say it. You can look up what a premier is, but a premier is like a president, but has legislative power. A lot like a vice president. If the secretary of state, secretary of treasury, etc., answered to the vice president, and and the vice president,、uh, I mean, there was another Congress also was there, but that's what a premier is. It's a it's slightly branches three four branches of government, slightly different, but it's very similar. Premier is important. And Taiwan's premier was also the mayor of、uh, where I've spent most of my time while I was in Taiwan. And I, I mean, he's awesome. He, Lai Qingde,、uh, William Lai, is incredibly awesome as a person. He drained the swamp. He wouldn't take corruption money. We had a, a dengue outbreak several years ago. People were getting sick and dying from mosquitoes, and he did everything he could. And then he went on his book tour, and that's bad optics. You're not supposed to go on a book tour when you're supposed to pretend to keep doing something to help a problem that you can't you can't possibly help anymore. And he said, "I'm a doctor." He was a doctor. the 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 mayor was a doctor,、uh, a general practitioner, I believe, and he would practice medicine on Mondays while he was mayor. He'd keep his clinic open and go to his clinic, and people would come, and he'd. He'd visit patients and you know check their heart condition or whatever, and and on Mondays while he was mayor, kept him. I mean, th- this guy's awesome. Mos- mosquitoes were biting, killing people with dengue, and the other political party, the swamp, was full of its whatever, and they would not send the money to spray for the mosquitoes in Tainan because they're from the other political party. So we'll let them die. Yeah, this is Taiwanese politics, absolutely horrendous. 
And Lai Chingda, the, the, the mayor, William Lai, did everything he could. He was asking for money from Taipei and they wouldn't send it because of party politics. And so he did everything he could and went on his book tour. And I, I think his book tour probably did a lot of good because people needed to meet a very good man who was not corrupt. He wouldn't take corruption money. And that alone made him the most popular of any mayor in Taiwan, I believe, ever. And so now he's the premier. It's an appointed position. It's not elected. And he's, he's, he, he is arguably more popular, maybe, maybe, than the president. And that's, that's been a question. But the president's... I'll, I mean, I do believe she is indeed older, but she was a premier before. That was her political experience. In the past, she had the same job. And she was leading this party for many, 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 many years against the old corruption problem. And so now she's president and you've got this younger, super popular mayor coming along. And well, mayor, it's more like governor. The, the translation's weird. It really should be called a governor. But you know, it's a small island. So state and city are coterminous. They're, the, they're the one and the same. So there were questions. Is there going to, you know, the, 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 the old leader who's been there a long time, is she going to have to fight? With, now, she's not that old. She's not that old. I mean, 29 is not all that old. Um, but, but, you know, she's, you know, is the, is the older leader who's been there going to have to fight with this young popular mayor? And like, like Qingdo, William Lai said, he said, no, I, I'm not going to be a second son in Taiwan's politics. I'm, I'm going to, you know, do my thing. And, and she's a great president and she's there and she is a great president. And so, I mean, the, the, one of the best things, one of the best things Taiwan's president, President Tsai ever did was congratulate Donald Trump on the phone because of all the peace that it made. It brought a lot of peace between the two, Taiwan and the United States. So I've been here and we've got these very good leaders in the country and they're draining the swamp. That Lai Qingda, the mayor, he did nothing. A lot of, he did what he needed to and then he didn't bring change, change, change. He just drained the swamp by not taking corruption money. And they're continuing this, they're continuing to press, uh, you know, whatever to, to be free and honest and not corrupt. And as they're doing that, they're fighting the old swamp. So when I talk about Taiwan's problems, Taiwan's problems are not the premier or the president's problems. They've been here a long time. So so I want to help Qingda and President Tsai as they are fixing Taiwan's problems by complaining about the problems that they want to fix. And that's very important for everyone to understand. That's the big lesson of this video. I am not criticizing the good people who are in Taiwan now. I am going to be making some very critical statements, but I never make a complaint without a solution. We're going to have to get to this in the next video. Cheerio.